About to enter the ring is the tag team combination managed by Bobby the Brain Heenan. From Atlantic City, New Jersey, weighing 468 pounds, wow. King Kong Bundy. That man is unbelievable. His tag team partner from Los Angeles, California, weighing 364 pounds, the giant John Studd. And Good John Studd. their opponents from Richmond, Virginia, weighing 238 pounds, the Rebel Dick Slater. There he is. His partner from Portland, Oregon, at 241 pounds, Ricky Hunter. Slater and Hunter certainly have their work cut out for them this week because they are meeting two bohemoths in that ring. Well, I'll tell you, Dick Slater and Rick Hunter are both tough, rugged wrestlers, but I'll tell you, personally, McMahon, I think they're giving away too much weight, too much strength to the most awesome tag team combination I consider in the world, Bundy and Stud. Well, it depends. Yes, they're awesome as far as their size is concerned and their overall girth and weight. Look at that. But if you can beat him to the punch, if you don't know want Slater, you can beat Stud and Bundy. There's no doubt of it. It's moving right in here. Dick Slaver, get him out for the right. No reversal. And here comes Da ah, missing. Stud missing on that ride. Going up now is Dick Slater and has him right where he wants him, Jess. How yeah, would you like to be there? Ooh, look at that. He Ooh. thinks he's got him where he wants him. <laughs> oh. Look at that, McMahon. Look at that. Now you tell me about power and strength, how it don't prevail, McMahon. Come on. Well, I must say, I'm almost at a loss for words. Yeah, aren't you? Slater whip off the rope, elbow. Down, but look out, missing with that. Earlier on, we had a conversation with him, the machine. Everyone knows Stud son, Bundy son. They turn away from tough competition. They fight only inferior competition. We now have new factory here in the United States, turning out machine after machine. We bring from Japan to the United States, new machine factory. We are here to stay. Matter of fact, there has been some talk about a, a Hulk machine or a, or a dog machine or a steel machine, something like that. All sorts of machines, huh? Yes. I find that a bit peculiar, McMahon. Well, the machines, you must uh, grant, Jesse, certainly every bit as awesome as far as No, I... no, no, no. They haven't proved themselves yet. Just nope. because they can wear some weird-looking masks don't necessarily make them tough. Ooh, Hunter whipped it to the back of the knee. You're, the looking, made... you're looking at the stud machine and the Bundy machine out there right now. Well, not a bad point. Not a bad point. Off the road. Elbow. No, just a plain old shoulder block and... And an easy one at that on a Bundy hardly move. Bruno, do you see that? Yes, but, you know, I'll disagree with Ventura 90% of the time. But when he's talking about these two studs and Bundy as one of the most powerful and biggest team, there's no question about it. Maybe the machines might have him beat on size. And even there, it's questionable. Thus far, machines having very little problem except when Dick Slater's in there. Well, I'll tell you, good, good tag team action. They're keeping Hunter... They're keeping Hunter in the corner, and they're hammering him. You know, these guys aren't just two big, awesome specimens and dumb. They're smart tag team wrestlers. Ricky Hunter now whip to the buckle. Big John Studd taking his time moving in. You know, you take the Bulldogs, though. I mean, there's a tag team that can beat Studd and Bundy. I, I don't I notice. I... Wait a minute, McMahon. I don't notice the Bulldogs putting up any titles against them. In fact, I'll go on record and say I believe the Bulldogs are ducking them. No, I don't believe so, Justin. And I think the Killer Bees have a good shot at them. Ooh, oh, look, look at that. that. Oh, That'll send you to the dentist quick. Looking at it is one thing, feeling it is something else, and at, what was it, 367 stud weight? 367, what, about 6 foot 10? That's an awesome physical being right there, Big John Stud. I mean, he, he's, he's so big, he can make someone like that too tall Jones look like a little few. Yeah, no doubt about that. We want the machines. We want machines, the fans are yelling. Watch this move. Stud helps him move. No. Avalanche. 
Covered by Bundy. And a three count. It's all over. Well, there's the stud in the Bundy machine, like I said. King Kong Bundy, Big John Stud, once again victorious. The winners of this bout, the team of the giant John Stud and King Kong Bundy. Yeah. They are awesome. And Bobby the Brain Heenan, very, very proud of his tag team combination. Mm. All right, here we go with a replay. As if Bundy can't do enough damage by himself, here's Stout giving him more help by swinging him against Rick Contra. And look at this, that 468 pounds come plunging like this, and Rick Contra is down and out. Boy, that's for sure. Yet to come, the Rougeaus versus Hercules Hernandez and his tag team partner. And of course, Morales and a whole bunch more will join us at Junkyard Dog right now. Let's take you to the interview.